The Turks and Caicos is dealing with a spike in immigration fraud, so leaders are working with Jamaica to help combat the issue. Our One Caribbean News, DeAndre Hamilton, explains. Fraud is becoming a cause for concern in the Turks and Caicos Islands, especially documents submitted for work permit applications. It is for this reason that the Minister of Immigration, Arlington Musgrove, has announced that the TCI will be collaborating with Jamaica to help in detecting fraudulent documents. Without going into details, there are a number of measures that Mr. Venter and his team has, has in place to validate documents, which I will not disclose at this point in time. And yet, they were achieving 80% delivery of responses within three working days. This is a significant achievement, especially as we seek to improve our service delivery in the Department of Visa and Immigration. In addition, to better protect the border of the TCI and crack down on the transnational shipment of guns and other illegal goods, Minister Musgrove mentioned that his ministry is looking to enter into an MOU with Jamaica and the Bahamas to improve the country's land security. Standing of the movement of transnational shipment of guns, drugs, and other undesirable goods, I think it's important for us to understand the role the Jamaican government plays just to its global position in the region. So we will be seeking to commence discussion to enter into, enter into uh, MOU with the Jamaican, the Bahamas, on this matter. The immigration minister noted that his ministry will be mirroring Jamaica's asylum management process to be better able to protect its staff. They have established an eligibility committee who assists in the decision-making, the safety of staff, in our line of business, there's always danger and risk to staff. So we got ideas on how we can better protect our staff. DeAndre Hamilton reporting.